And here we have the second game of the third match, and this hand seems good. Like the mulligan. It has air while, which is good against him, and it has war motion marshal, which is good against him, and it has Kempo Incinerator, which is also good against him. And it has Ringleader, which is also it has all good cards. Like only thing this needs is land. Uh so I don't know if he plays but well, let's see what happens if I play it or Okay, it resolves. Does he start with a prop decay here? He does. Uh, at the moment, I only want to draw land. So, it seems like I'm going to be paying Echo for the Mock War Marshal. If he plays nothing, then I'm going to pay Echo. If he plays something that dies to Incinerator, then I'm going to Incinerate. Incinerator. Yeah, now I'm going to Incinerator. And hope now I get two draws, so I hope I'm gonna find a land. All I need is land. That's good. And more land would be fine. No, it's already but Relic is acceptable. Uh, let's. Uh, yeah, he might have Storm Stalker, so I'm gonna start by removing cards from his graveyard. Attack for one. Yeah, pretty much. That's bad. No, not Gringo. So. So let's attack. I'm gonna coupling matron, but I don't know what I'm gonna find with coupling matron. Let's start by exciting. What would I even find? With, yeah, Kogari's charm would be really bad. I, mean, I think I need just need to find ring later with. The other option, pretty much, pretty much the only other option I would consider is Chieftain. I do have double incinerator, which cycle for cards, so... I'm gonna go with, I'm gonna try the Chieftain. Since I do have double incinerator, so I'm gonna probably find more gas. And if I get Chieftain on the battlefield, it makes me kill him faster and also protects my guy from Golgari Charm. And gives haste to everything, so let's start by casting it. So he must have something, he's four cards, so I'm sure he must have something here. Okay, this figure. And does he have something more? Like Hogari Charm. That's bad. A good draw, or well, I yeah, I li I like that draw. I like being at four mana. Uh, so the only thing I'm wondering if I should be using relic. I'm I'm a little bit scared about 
Tombstalker. If he had Tombstalker, he would have played it last turn. And then holding Relic as long as possible is always good. Nothing here. I should not have a fetch here. I'm getting the last mountain. I don't wanna I don't wanna cycle Kempo incinerators for nothing. So I'm thinking about using the red eight here. Yeah, I'm gonna use the red eight. And now I wish I had a little land since I'd like to waste that. Either while well, doesn't really do anything here. Black green. Let's go with the, that plan. Ah, uh, yeah. I don't need any. I don't think. Yeah, I think I'm gonna just wait with this game power incinerator since I think I will win, win that long game. Okay. Now I would need a double. Since this goes into the graveyard, so it doesn't actually. Like, I would need to double. Yeah, I don't like. Double Kempo incinerating. Since if I draw a coupling, then I can just use a single Kempo incinerator. Well, that's. Yeah, I think I'm gonna guess that. I hope he doesn't have days. I wonder if he has a second Golgari charm here. Which wouldn't be the wouldn't be that bad since I would still have Okay, so and that's gonna work so that I'm gonna shoot him. Since when the since Termago is gonna be quite big here. And I don't need to shoot anything else. Okay, so he gets a big brainstorm. And so next turn probably gonna start by camp on incinerating Tarmogoyf. If nothing changes on the board. I hope he taps out, cast one more Tarmogoyf or something along those lines. I hope he doesn't like I hope he doesn't leave removal spells up so so that he doesn't mess with my incinerators. Pitting needle. Yeah, I think that's fine. Wasn't really expecting him to have pitting needles. Uh, yeah, I could have like shot with sharpshooter here, but no, I don't think I. I think I would rather have it untapped than deal one damage. I can always attack for one damage later on. He aims either while. Okay. And I think I'm gonna take it here. Which makes me suspect that he has Colgate Charm here, since he named either what actually. 
She's going to turn my glaze, it's fine. So now I'm going to double camp home incinerator and be in a really good position. And I drew a ringleader also. So let's kill that. Oh, missed one damage. My bad. How about another camp home incinerator? And this time I'm gonna remember to shoot one image. Land would be nice. Mm, Relic is acceptable. And then I'm gonna attack for. Make him exile a card and then I'm gonna attack for three. And I think I this I have won this one. I don't see myself losing from this position, but I have been wrong in other uh, in other times also. So like training is okay. So you deal three damage a turn. Yeah, this has just been, so yeah. Just making sure I can't shoot it with yeah. Can't shoot. Uh, so yeah, I'm gonna start by uh, casting Green Leader. A few matrons. And then cast Pile Driver and hope he doesn't have days. He does not. Exile. One card from him, attack for attack with everyone. And shoot him once. And he goes down to 4 damage, 4 life. And I have protection from blue creature here. Okay, that was the third match. I'll be back for the fourth and final match of this daily event.